Healing Stink Binder, heading out to the beautiful Laurel Highlands to do a little bit of investigative reporting. Stanley Stinkfinder from FART News, he reports, you decide. We're heading out this today to Ligonier Camp. Uh, we have an undercover investigator who is looking into some of the kitchen practices at Ligonier Camp. We're excited to find out whether there's something there or not. Stinkfinder from FART News is here and he's coming up to interview you guys for some reason. He's talking about like standards and wanting to know what's going on up here and it seems like he's, I don't know, but if you have to do something to get ready for him, you have like no time hello? to do so. Hello? Hello? Oh boy, here How he is. You? Stanley Stinkfinder from FART News. I report, you decide. Are you April? Yes. Hi, April. Hi. I'm Stanley. It's nice to nice see you. I'm just here. I've heard a few things about your kitchen procedures and policies. No need to get nervous or upset or any type of concern. I'm just here just to report. People will decide on their own, but I don't know if you have a few minutes for me just to talk a little bit with you about, you know, how you, how you do your job that you do here at Ligonier Camp and Conference Center. Stanley Stinkfinder from FART News here with April discussing some of her kitchen policies. So April, um, it's so nice of you to spend some time meeting with me. I was just wondering uh, about some of your policies and standards that you use here at Ligonier Camp Kitchen. Um, tell me, the, the, the serve safe standards, do you meet all serve safe standards here at Ligonier Camp Kitchen? Yeah, we do. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, how about um, uh, ACA, American Camping Association standards? Do you meet those standards here at the kitchen as well? Of course we do. Mm -hmm, of course you do. Of course you do. What about if OSHA were to step into the kitchen? Would, would OSHA approve of your practices and how you cook your breakfast and your lunch and your dinners? Yes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, how about this? What about FDA? If FDA were to come and do an inspection of your kitchen, would you meet their standards as well? Of course. You would. Uh-huh. Interesting. What if I told you this? What if I told you that I have an undercover investigator that has been working for you for the last few months? Would that, would that change any of your uh, comments or, or responses? No. 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 Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. None of them. None of them. You would say nothing different if I told you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. Well, let's take a look at some of the footage that our undercover investigator has taken for FART News. We report, you decide. Joey, Stink Finder says that somebody has been working undercover on our staff. Who? I have no idea. Uh, who do you think it is? I have no idea. I, who would do it? Uh, Nikki. Jesse? Kayla? Linda? Linda.
Right. Well, after seeing the video, what do you have to say for yourself? Um, do you want some breakfast? Sure. I'd love some breakfast. Oh my goodness, this looks fabulous. Did you? Oh, yes, you did make this. I, I remember. Oh my goodness, look at. Mm, 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 mm. This is unbelievable. Do you want some oh, orange juice? I would. Oh my goodness, I would. Mm, I would love some orange juice. Oh! Is that freshly squeezed? It is. Oh my goodness, that's delicious. This is this is fantastic. Excuse me. This is Stanley Stinkfinder. I report. You decide. Signing off. Smell you later.